Gas prices keep moving well past the $3 mark here in northeast Wisconsin. Fox City's area prices as high as $3.12 a gallon today. Green Bay area, many stations nearing $3.15, meaning we're a few cents above the national average. Good evening, everyone, and some people say they're beginning to feel the pinch in the pocketbook. And some forecasters are predicting $4 a gallon this coming summer. So how does this all weigh on an economy trying to make a comeback? Fox 11 Becky DeVries takes a look at the impact of the jump at the pump. They're getting a little higher, and it's affecting the pocketbook a little bit more. Mark Oberstar, like many of us, is noticing the increasing numbers at the gas pump. I think the number one thing is you got to really look at what your spending is and where you can cut back in certain ways. You know, uh, this is my car that I go back to forth, but I don't drive my truck as much anymore. For others, a trip to the pump is something of a mind game. I put $52 in last time, so I'm trying to keep it you know, above half, so it seems like I'm not putting in as much, even though the prices are going up. I would just don't want to seem like I'm having to pay a fortune, but I know it's going to keep going up. Nationally, as our economy comes out of that uh, decline that we've experienced, uh, we're seeing an increasing demand for the gasoline. John Stoll says that demand is part of the economic turnaround. However, the raised prices may slow down the turnaround close to home. I expect it be, would naturally have some kind of a dampening effect on the economy. Uh, as gasoline prices go up, the cost of companies like locally Schneider and, and other people that are moving equipment and supplies and goods, their costs are going up, which means the profit margins for businesses that are having to pay for those services are going to decline. And that's going to slow down their profitability and their, their willingness to hire additional labor or other kinds of resources. A slowdown that appears to be headed for an economy that is trying to rebound. In Green Bay, Becky DeVries, Fox 11 News. Now, Stoll does also say the higher prices might be a good thing from an efficiency standpoint. They may, he says, actually encourage people to look for and develop more environmentally friendly technology.